statistically speaking, right, if we observed some sort of alien life, it would most likely be some sort of virally self-replicating von Neumann-like probe system, right? And and it's possible that there, you know, there are such systems that I don't know what they're doing at the bottom of the ocean, allegedly, but maybe they're, you know, collecting minerals uh, from the bottom of the ocean. Yeah. Um, but that wouldn't violate violate any of my priors. But uh, am I certain that these systems are here? And it, it'd be difficult for me to say so, right? I only have secondhand information about there being data. About right? the bottom of the ocean? <laughs> yeah, but, you know, could it be things like memes? Could it be thoughts and ideas? Hmm. Could they be operating at that medium? Could aliens be the very thoughts that come into my head? Like, what do you, have you, hmm. how do you know that, the, how do you know that that, what's the origin of ideas in your mind? When an idea comes to your head, show me where it originates. I mean, frankly, <laughs> uh, when I had the idea for the type of computer I'm building now, I think it was eight years ago now, it really felt like it was being beamed from space. It, it, it just, I was in bed just shaking, just thinking it through and I don't know. Uh, but do I believe that legitimately? I don't think so. I, but, it, you know, I, I, I think that um, alien life could take many forms. And I think the notion of intelligence and the notion of life needs to be expanded uh, much more broadly uh, to be less anthropocentric or biocentric.